First at five, Governor Bill Lee could sign his school safety bill into law as early as next week, which would increase security and mental health resources at schools. It's a big one. WSMV 4's Courtney Allen has more on what changes are being discussed and how some parents feel about it. The governor's proposed bill aims to strengthen school security, a topic that parents say is a priority. Sarah Reschke says her 16 year old son made a big decision during COVID. He elected to stay home and do online schooling because his life is too precious to risk it. Choosing to remain homeschooled for the rest of high school rather than returning to the classroom. Just the thought that a a shooter could come into school or God forbid one of the armed officers be overtaken and those guns be used. Following the Covenant school shooting, Tennessee lawmakers are discussing ways to make children feel safer. Mr. Clark, take the vote. Thursday, the Senate unanimously passed an amended version of the governor's school safety bill. Changes include requiring all schools built or remodeled starting in July to make exterior windows and doors bulletproof on the floor and basement levels. The bill would also add an armed security guard to every public school, increase mental health resources, and require every public and private school to make annual safety plans. So I stand in support of this bill because I do think, and even you've heard here on the floor, the consensus that these things can work that these things can help. Democrats say the bill is a short term solution, calling it, quote, woefully inadequate for concerned parents. I don't think that they're looking for us to be prepared for the next school shooting so much as to try to prevent the next school shooting. One thing both sides agree on, children need protection. My kid's life is worth more. There's n there is nothing on the earth that's worth more than someone's life. The bill as amended will now go back to the House Monday, and if they approve it, it will then go to Governor Bill Lee's desk to sign. Courtney Allen, WSMV4.